hematuria indicates disease progression in patients with chronic kidney disease. Hematuria, where the red blood cells are detected in the urine, can be caused by an injury in the glomerular filtration barrier. This injury can lead to oxidative stress, inflammation and can initiate structural damage to the kidney. Several studies have investigated the correlation of hematuria with adverse outcomes including significant kidney function loss, end-stage renal disease, ESRD, or death. The aim of the study was to evaluate the association between hematuria and progression of chronic kidney disease, CKD, end-stage renal disease, ESRD, and all-cause death. The patients diagnosed with chronic kidney disease, whose estimated glomerular filtration rate was 20 to 70 milliliters per minute per 1.73 square meters, at baseline, were recruited in the study. The age of the patients ranged from 21 to 74 years. Individuals diagnosed with polycystic kidney disease, multiple myeloma, glomerulonephritis treated with immunosuppression, or a kidney transplant were excluded from the study. A sum of 3,272 patients who met the inclusion criteria were included in the multicenter prospective cohort study. All the subjects underwent a dipstick examination. A positive dipstick was the predictor of hematuria. The primary outcome was time to a composite of a 50% or greater reduction in EGFR from baseline or ESRD. The secondary outcomes considered were time to ESRD, which was defined as date of dialysis initiation or kidney transplantation, and time to death. Individuals with hematuria, who were diagnosed with dipstick examination were more likely to be Hispanic, have diabetes, lower mean EGFR, and higher levels of urinary albumin more than 1 gram per day, compared to those persons who had negative dipstick result. Individuals with hematuria, who were diagnosed with dipstick examination were more likely to be Hispanic, have diabetes, lower mean EGFR, and higher levels of urinary albumin more than 1 gram per day, compared to those persons who had negative dipstick result. The study results suggest that hematuria was significantly correlated with higher risk of CKD progression and death within the first two years of follow-up after determination of hematuria. Identifying the pattern of hematuria over a time period and its correlation with clinical outcomes will provide information to understand its predictive value in CKD patients.